Okay. Hello. I am filming in my room, so I won't be able to really see everything that well, but I am here to make a haul video. Hopefully you can see me. I have my like camera balanced. This is my Pikachu hat. It has like the ears on the sides. But anyway, I want to show you some things that I bought. And sorry the lighting in here is kind of off. It's my room lighting is kind of gross. <laughs> um first thing I have here is Maybelline Dream Nude Air Foam um, Foundation in 110 Porcelain Ivory. You shake it up a lot, like up to like 40 seconds or so. Then you spray it onto the back of your hand and you rub it in circular motions around your face. If you want to use a brush, I guess you could or use like a beauty blender sponge, but I use my fingers and I'm wearing it right now. And it pretty much well, it makes it look like not cakey, it makes it look more natural, it makes your skin feel really soft. But it's a light to like medium coverage foundation. It's not full coverage, but if you want to build it up, it'll be a little more full coverage. So yeah. I do recommend that. And right here I have Hard Candy Glossaholic Lip Gloss and Tipsy. You can get this at Walmart because it's only like Walmart's brand. It has an applicator sponge that's actually pretty thick and ginormous. Like that. You may want to be careful because some of the lip gloss tends to splurge out when I'm wearing that right now on my lips. Another thing. Here's the packaging, but it's an e.l.f. foundation brush. It's really silky, has like a grayish, like light black tint on it on the top. And it tends, well it's claiming to, like basically achieve an ultra smooth poreless finish while applying foundation or tinted moisturizer. For best results, use upward brush um, brush strokes and yeah and I found it really neat because it has like the fake little jewels on it that I haven't really seen elf do I don't know if it was like part of the Christmas like set thing going on or what but yeah I didn't use it yet but if I will I'll tell you guys how it went and then I purchased these many times and it's the elf Ring liver wipes, cleansing cloths. I love those. It takes makeup off a lot easier than what I have right here. The Blum or Blue Naturals that tend to, I had to use more wipes and do smear my makeup, so I recommend the other ones a lot more. The Elf. And I've had this before, but it shattered on me, which is the Tone Correcting Powder. It's called Complexion Perfection. Comes in a yellow, like a babyish blue, light green, and a pink. And you can like fix the redness on your face and use like a brush, like a powder brush and even out your skin tone. And I recommend this a lot. It comes in handy. But if you're using a foundation, you don't want your face to look cakey, make sure you apply it only a little bit because that's all you need. And a little bit of this goes a long way. You need like a walnut sized amount. And this I did not use yet are um, Kiss Fake Eyelashes that actually come with strings so that you get like a flawless application. application. Yeah. You wait 30 to 60 seconds for the adhesive to become slightly, slightly clear and tacky. And then you hold the strings from the outer corner working your way in and wait for the adhesive to dry then gently pull the string away and there goes your lash. I don't wear fake eyelashes a lot but I thought these were pretty neat in the concept. So yeah, I'll tell you how this goes. 
And that's pretty much it. Oh, and if you want, here's my other hat my friend gave me. <laughs> you can see it. Now I'm gonna go. Talk to you later, YouTube.